Have you ever heard of improvisation? This word can mean lots of different things depending on the setting that you're in. In a music setting, improvisation means creating music on the spot. Usually when you improvise music, you have some kind of plan or format that you have to follow along. But the specific notes that you'll play or sing are not planned out, and you just make them up as you go. Improvisation is easy within the framework of a pentatonic scale. In a pentatonic scale, remember, there are only five notes, and those notes all sound good when played together. I have a glockenspiel here in front of me, and it is in a uh, pentatonic scale right now. So I can play any of the notes. Let me grab another mallet. I can play any of the notes together and it will still sound good. I just made that up as I went along. I improvised. On Quaver, in your next page in Canvas, you will go to this ORF instrument. As you see on the screen beside me, this ORF instrument is not in a pentatonic scale because there are more than just five of the same notes. I have C, D, E, F, G, A, and B. That's seven, not five. So we need to take away two bars to make it a pentatonic scale. To do that, I'm going to, for today, take away all of the E's and B's. In my music class, we often call that the bacon and eggs. So I'll take away the eggs and bacon. And to take them away on Quaver, all you do is drag them to that yellow bucket where it says ORF bars. Once I've dragged away the E's and B's, or eggs and bacon, I'll be left with an instrument that looks like this. Now it's in an extended pentatonic scale because there are only five different types of notes, even though some are longer or lower and some are higher or shorter, it's still an extended pentatonic because there's only five different types. Now it will be easy for you to improvise along this instrument. If you mess up, which is totally fine, and you need to replace a bar, this button here that says replacement bar will allow you to drag the bar back to replace any of these. So remember, you need the E's and B's gone so that you're left with C's, D's, F, G's, and A's. It's your turn to try improvising on an ORF instrument in Quaver. Happy music making!